friends welcome back to my channel today I am going to be playing around with this uh, washi sticker set that I got from BB crafts um, I did a haul video on the items that I got from BB crafts if you want to check that out the other items so these are nautical themed um, as you can see there's a lot of whales and seashells and some um, coral um, so all different kinds of washi tape here. I'll kind of show them to you. They're really, really pretty. So we have this one that has the big orca whales, a bunch of different whales on them. And what else we have here? And then we have some more fish and bubbles, some more coral, some starfish, school of fish, some more shells, some more whales. Um, there's some jellyfish on one of these, maybe this one, and then just some stripes and blue ones. So I thought what I would do is I am working on a um, kind of under the sea journal and so I thought I would decorate a few tags so I've started out so I'm also using some napkin so here is one tag that I've done here using this napkin and this is some uh, vintage kind of um, this looks like this nostalgics vintage trim I thought that kind of had a nautical nautical theme to it here I was trying my hand at those rub-ons from the Dollar Tree and another little napkin here. And I really like these rub-ons. Um, if they ever have more of these, I'm going to have to try to find some more. And then with the washi tape, so here I've just taken a piece of scrap paper and I had a tag that was from an old auction and I thought I would make a little side pocket here. Because I had this from the auction um, on this side, so I wanted to cover that up. So I made this little side pocket, and then I put a little bit of this um, washi tape right here of the fish. Hopefully y'all can see that okay. And then I inked around the edges with um, Salty Ocean on that particular one. And then here's another tag where I thought it would be fun just to um, take three different types of washi and lay them down. So I have the coral fish and the jellyfish and, sh and shells, seashells. And then I had some of this, um, this fabric here. Um, and this was actually from the Dollar Tree. And so I put that on there because to me it looks a little um, oceany. And I like the little touch of the sequins. So I thought I would play around with a few more, um, turn the camera on, and have a little play. So I have a few of these tags over here. And I just cut down my tags um, myself. So I thought we could look at the tags, or look at the washi tape, and decorate them up onto the tags. So I hope everyone is doing well. Let me know what you all are up to in the comments down below. I've never done a nautical or under the sea type of journal before. Just thought it would be fun. I'd come across some different um, vintage books. And so I thought that would be neat. I really like this washi tape. It's really pretty. So I'm just kind of playing around um, with the different ones. So I can kind of get a feel what they look like. This one tore a little bit, which is a bummer. I think we'll... I like that on the brown. That's pretty cool. 
suppose I can wrap it around. Interesting. That. I think washi tape is a fun and easy way to add um, some decoration to your tags. Yeah, that looks really nice. Like that. I apologize if the lighting isn't very good. Um, it's the time of the day when sun is just shining in in my craft room. Alright, so I really like both of these. Trim this up a little bit better here. I might try a little stencil on here. I have these stencils here. I'm going to the lake this weekend. Right last time for this boating season. The water has been just beautiful this year. Okay, I like that. That looks very nice. And then I'll ink up the edges. in the salty ocean again. So I really like this washi tape. This pack, I really like the number, the quantity that you get. Um, I'll have a link down below. Can't remember the price of it. Um, that's so cute and simple. I like trying to uh, keep them a little bit of simple. I can always add some other little pieces um, down the road, but I think that's a nice little start. I'll poke a hole. Um, I'll probably sew around them, so um, I think that's a good start for now. And then for this one, That's too big. Let's see. Got another set. These might be too big too. Let's see. This is um my first time really trying these. these stencils from the Dollar Tree and they're not bad. I think what I might do is a little collection of starfish. Let's see if I can get them on here. And maybe a little fish. I like a little teeny tiny little fish. 
fish. my camera guys sorry about that and I apologize if you can hear the lawnmower it's that time of the day and it's not raining today and we've had a lot of rain so definitely needs cutting Do not go into the other stencil there. good and I might go over them with a little bit of this chip sapphire Yeah, I kind of like that with the color of the whale a bit there. So, and these colors, these inks, these Tim Holtz inks do blend very nicely together. Nice. Okay, I think that looks good. That looks good, and then we're going to ink up around the edges. And you can tell, look at my inky fingers, you all. Such a, a messy crafter. we have so far so we have this one we have this one we have this one and we have this one see them so all right maybe let's try one more and I might try Some with the stripes.
just playing around. And I haven't tried the bubbles. I'm going to see what these bubbles look like. Eyeball that spacing pretty good, didn't I? I didn't try. Oh, that looks pretty. And, oops. It's over on itself. Oh, I like that. It's very nice. I'll do one more stripe at the bottom here. Right, that looks good. I don't know if I should do a bubble across the top. Up. So hopefully I'm giving you all some ideas of ways to use a washi tape besides just kind of putting them on a page which is always a good idea and I will definitely use these on my journal pages but I was just in the mood to make a few tags today and I think I'm gonna do the salty ocean with this one Let's see I also have what other blue I have faded jean Speckled egg, yeah. I think the salty ocean. And I'll probably sew around this one as well. And I'll put a hole up there. And I might even do a little stenciling maybe up there, that white part. All right, guys, I am going to kind of stop here. You kind of get the, the gist of the idea of this washi tape. And I think it just adds a whole lot of interest to your project very quickly and very easily. I really like it on the brown as well. And here, just subtle with a little washi tape. And I want to find some sort of image to put on here. I haven't figured that out just yet and like I said I'm going to probably sew around these and um, you know maybe add some additional detail um, underneath so anyway thank you all so much for stopping by and I hope you give this washi tape a try I mean I don't um, make any money off of it or anything like that um, I just received it for free so I wanted to kind of share with you all um, what it looks like and the quality of it. If you'd want to see like every single one of these in more detail, leave a comment down below and I could do a little washi um, sample on a page um, so you all can kind of see what each one looks like. Just let me know. I'm happy to do that. All right. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all on the next video. Oh, I really like these. Love y'all. Bye.